This is Mary Beth Gard down at Capers Emporium, and I'm here with Rhonda Hunter. Hi. And hey, Rhonda, how would you like to help? We have these uh, vegetables that we want to mince really, really fine. Like to make some soup. What do you think? I think it'd be awesome. Good. I love soup. Do you want to just chop them all up? What are you talking about, Willis? <laughs> well, you know, uh, we do have some of the best knives that you could ever find. They're the Victorinox knives and our uh, lovely cutting board. You don't really seem enthusiastic I love to about eat. this. I love yes. to eat, but I don't like to prepare. Ah. A little, I know that you have some kind of awesome little gadget. <laughs> I can't wait to see which one it is she today. She knows me well. Okay. I love your gadget. Your, your healer is But I do remember what this does. And so do you want to try using it? Yeah, let's see if I can do it. The ordinary person. Not that we need it. We really just need this to do the soup stuff. And this is the Thai Kiwi Peeler. And you can use this on cucumbers or carrots or um, whatever kind of vegetable. It is so cool. Here's the cool part. Here's what I like. Yeah, Cause, that is so you know, cool. Okay, that's interesting and you've got shreds that you can use for things, but when you are making a salad or something, look how beautiful those little cuts are. I know and I love Adorable. beautiful carrots. Yes, I do too. Mm -hmm. By the way, if you're left-handed and you haven't found a peeler that that really fits you well. I don't care whether you're right or left-handed, the Universal Peeler by Gefu just works perfectly and it's so um, sharp, it makes quick work of this. So if you're thinking about punishing your kids and saying, go peel that pile of potatoes, they won't mind doing it if they let, have the let right Let me try, tools. can it's, I try? Yes. Because it's a punishment yourself. to me. I have to prepare my food every week. Gosh, it's, it's really it's so fast. Look at this, it's so fast. Oh, and I didn't cut myself like some other gadgets. I won't say what I bought, but wow, okay, and it's so we need pretty. Some left. I'm taking know, the peeler so away from you now. <laughs> this is the ninja, and I like the kind of ninja where the motor goes on the top instead of underneath. <laughs> It's like a blender, but it has some stack blade technology so that it is going to uh, not just do the very bottom, but it's going to do. I love the color. That is the color of my kitchen. Yeah, I thought the ninjas nice? were black. Well, they had been for years and years, and then they decided, you know, people love color and they like things to match what they're doing. So we actually have the Ninja in seven or eight different colors from yellow and orange to aqua and purple and red and everything in between. So much easier. <laughs> so much easier. You just put your lid on like this and it only fits on one way. You put the motor on top oh, wow. and then there are two things that you can do with the Ninja. You can pulse it or you can just mash it and if you pulse it you're going to just do movements like this and uh, i deliberately chose I would not to have that. the pieces of carrot in different sizes you know you hear all the time that you need things in uniform size and that's true if you're going to be cooking something but we weren't going to be cooking we were going to be uh, finely dicing and so I have the different size pieces in there and it all comes out absolutely perfectly so now I can dump this onto here I and like I this new ninja with too my, with my uh, celery and the blade just fits in there it's a very easy thing to wash also because you can just rinse it out and then put it in the dishwasher we're going to be making soup we're going to use some of the leaves too if you were doing something else where you weren't cooking it you might think hmm, you don't want the leaves in there would you like to pulse i do want to pulse I thought you might. 
This is so different than mine. I love it. It looks easier. It really is easy to use. Okay, I'll hold it and you pulse it. You just push this? Mash on top. Just. That's kind of fun. Yeah, just a little bit at a time. Boom. Kind of vibrate your Quick finger. <laughs> motions and you've got the see through container so you know when it's done. This would be fun with my grandbaby. Yes. She would have fun. Okay, you're okay. done. <laughs> So, uh, if we had an onion here today, we'd do the onion too. But you see how beautifully and uniformly it has minced the celery for us. So, um, we're ready to make soup. This is the longest uh, step in the soup making process. When you do this, this is going to take more time than anything else. So if you well, can didn't put take it down long. to what, 30 seconds yeah. here, 30 seconds there, maybe a minute if you're stretching it, then we're ready to saute these. You can do the same thing with onion. I forgot to uh, put an onion in here. And those you are your building blocks of most soups. You can make coleslaw because you can mince up your uh, cabbage, your onion, uh, any of the other ingredients you want to put in there. This comes in handy for lots of different things. It also mixes, so if I wanted to mix uh, batter for muffins or something like that, I could do that in there. Instead of doing the pulsing motion, I do the pulse in the beginning to kind of get it mixed up, and then I would just mash down on the button and have it go continuously. You can put cream in here. It takes a little over one minute, super chilled, heavy cream, just one cup, and then you're gonna use uh, two tablespoons of um, sugar or Splenda in there and a little bit of vanilla, or you could shake it up and do almond extract or something else. You're gonna mash on that, remove the lid, and you've got beautiful whipped cream ready to serve. So, I think it would be awesome too for your smoothies in the morning. You put your fruit in your carrot and make a smoothie really quick with that. Yes, oh, it gosh. would. The it's possibilities a tap away. are a tap endless. Away. A tap away. So, um, thanks for helping, Rhonda. You're welcome. Thanks for showing me this. Now I gotta yes. get this. Now you're going to be able to skip all the chop, chop, chop. And it was my birthday, so maybe we can talk somebody into getting me this for the color of my house, my birthday. Good idea. We can text him, and maybe. Good idea. We do have <laughs> wish lists at Capers, so if you want to fill a wish list with ideas for those who are looking for presents for you, we can help you out there. So come on down to Capers. We're the happy place to shop. You will be happy with these gadgets.